Hi everybody! Um, today we're going to read out of our Bible and we're going to read the whole Christmas story today. An angel visits Mary. God sent the angel Gabriel to visit a young woman. Her name was Mary. She was scared. She never had seen an angel before. Gabriel said, don't be afraid. You are very special to God. You will become pregnant and give birth to a son. You must name him Jesus. He will be called the Son of the Most High God. Mary asked, How can it be so? I am not married. Gabriel answered, With God all things are possible. Mary said, I love God. I will do what he has chosen me to do. Mary loved Joseph. Mary and Joseph were going to be married soon. Joseph lived in Nazareth, but his family lived in Bethlehem. A new leader named Caesar ordered all people to go back to their homeland. He wanted to count all the people in his kingdom. So Mary and Joseph went to Bethlehem. Mary was going to have her baby soon. When they arrived in Bethlehem, they looked for a safe place to sleep, but all the inns were full. Finally, a man was able to help them. He said, I don't have any rooms left, but you are welcome to sleep in my stable. Joseph made a warm place for Mary to rest. While they were there, little baby Jesus was born. Mary wrapped Jesus in strips of cloth and gently laid him in a manger. On the night Jesus was born, shepherds were watching their sheep. Suddenly an angel stood before them, and God's light shined all around. The angel said, Do not be afraid. I bring joyful news to all people. Today in the town of Bethlehem, a Savior has been born. He is lying in a manger. Then a chorus of angels appeared. They sang, Glory to God in the highest. Peace and goodwill to everyone on earth. The shepherds rushed to Bethlehem. There they found baby Jesus. They told Mary and Joseph what the angel said. As they returned to their sheep, the shepherds told everyone what they had seen and heard. All along the way, the shepherds shouted praises to God. The end. Thanks for listening. I hope you have a great week. I'll see you next time. Bye.